On immigration, some legal scholars believe you can get rid of birthright citizenship without changing the constitution. With you an could... executive order. Exactly. Right. Uh, have you thought about that? Yes. Tell me more. It was always told to me that you needed a constitutional amendment. Right. Guess what? Amendment. You don't. You don't. Number one. Number one, you don't need that. Number two, I mean, that's, in dispute. You could definitely that's very much do, in dispute. Well, you can definitely do it with an act of Congress, but now they're saying I can do it just with an executive order. Now, how ridiculous. We're the only country in the world where a person comes in, has a baby, and the baby is essentially a citizen of the United States for 85 years with all of those benefits. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. And it has to end. Um, have you talked about that with counsel? Yeah. I have. So where in the process? It's in the process. It'll happen. This With year. an executive order. That's what you're talking about, right? Yeah, that's it's a exactly very interesting what I was talking about. I didn't think anybody but knew that but me. I thought I was the only one. Jonathan, I've I'm got impressed. a good guess. Good I'm guess. Impressed.